Come bless the Lord, all you servants of the Lord, you that by night stand in the house of the Lord. Lift up your hands towards the sanctuary and bless the Lord, the Lord who made heaven and earth. Give to you his blessing out of Zion. Thus may the Lord Almighty, our God and Saviour, grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. For our help is in the name of this Lord, who made the heavens and the earth. As we come to the end of this day, we acknowledge our need of forgiveness, and so together we say, Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed, and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins. Heal us by your Spirit and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. With the confidence that our requests are answered, we say, Before the ending of this day, Creator of the world, we pray that you with steadfast love would keep your watch around us while we sleep. But before we sleep we long to hear from God in his word. Tonight we listen to the prophet Jeremiah in chapter 38 verse 20 of his book where he says, Please listen to the Lord's voice. The message I am sharing with you. Then he will do good to you. And your souls will be revived. Jeremiah's call is an enduring one. The path to enjoy the Lord's blessing and above all his presence is by listening, really listening to him when he speaks and freely submitting to all that we hear from him when he speaks. Lord our God, help us to relearn the basic steps of the spiritual life Give us ears that listen, and minds, hearts, hands, and feet to follow you. Abide with us, Lord Jesus, for the night is at hand and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. And so may the Lord our God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit bless us and watch over us. May the Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. May the Lord look kindly on us and give to us his peace.